Hi, my name is Orlando from Skint Guitars in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Before I start posting stuff for my 2022 Great Guitar Build-Off entry, I'd like to share a video that has been a massive inspiration to me. Minervino Guimarães, or as we'd call him around here, Seu Minervino, was a traditional guitar builder who lived in the San Francisco region, which is in the poor and arid portion of the state of Minas in Brazil. He specialized in building and playing the viola caipira, a ten-stringer that is derived from Portuguese guitars like the viola de Braga. It was my good friend Bruno, a very talented musician who told me about Seu Minervino. Bruno owns one of Minervino's guitars and it's a great instrument. There's a famous Brazilian luthier also, who's a collector called Valmir Rosa, who posted a review on YouTube of one of Minervino's excellent guitars. I'll post the links in the video notes. As you guys view the footage, you'll see that Minervino has very, very, very basic tools, in keeping with the fact that he lives in a place without running water or electricity. Much of the work is done with saws, knives and a large machete. He does use a rasp, a plane and a hand drill, but that's about it. The wooden sheets for the guitar top and bottom are done using a saw and later finished with a plane. The sides are bent by soaking the wood after being made nice and thin with the plane. The neck is shaped using a machete and then sanded with a rasp. The tuners are wooden pegs and the holes are made with a hand drill.
The guitar is very decorated. The bridge has side details that remind me of Salvador Dali's moustache and flower-like inlays and the body has a dark binding that highlights the light-coloured wood. This is quite typical of viola caipiras and the viola gibraga. Bruno's guitar has a very basic varnish coat where you can plainly see the brush strokes. The frets are made by banging out copper electric wire on an improvised anvil and then cutting the flat strips with a hammer and chisel with the help of a, a tiny little apprentice. And if you were wondering, all the music in this video is played by Silmini Havina himself on one of his guitars. I think that kind of says it all.